Hello everyone and welcome to episode 3 of the 5 Minute Stitch. Day 1 of week number 2 and this is quickly proving to be kind of effective. Um, as you can see from the last episode that I have not stitched anything else on this or any other piece. So, um, as I explained last episode, hopefully this time, this will kind of kick me into the groove and I might be able to get some stitching done on other things today. Like, since I recorded the last video that went up on Thursday, I did not... I have not stitched on anything at all. So, I'm hoping that this will... You know, like I was saying in the other episode, this will kickstart uh, something, and then I will be able to go and grab one of the Christmas pieces and stitch on it. They desperately need finished. Um, at this rate, they're going to be turning into birthday presents instead of late Christmas presents. But, um, yesterday was the 100th post on the blog. Um, and I did, like I said I was going to do, it was basically like a little compilation of the top ten articles, oops, top ten articles for the last 100 posts. So basically the top ten articles of all time, I guess. Of course, um, railroading being number two on that list, it was the top article for an extremely long time. It was like uh, several months before another article actually topped it, which was the uh, the Paula Vaughan piece that I rescued. And of course you can see all of these if you uh, go to the blog. You can read all these articles for yourself that I'm talking about. There are also links in the description to the video and on the description to the article post. But as for this piece, uh oh, we are getting to a half quarter stitch thing going on here. As for this piece, there is really there is really not much left. What you see here is about what's there. All I have to do is finish this color, which goes down to like here, I think. And then this piece will be done. All I have to do is do the back stitch and then frame it. And I'll have to move on to another piece for these videos. Um, I've specific been specifically not stitching on this piece because I'm using it for these videos. Um, but as I said earlier, I have not been stitching on anything at all recently. I'm on a little bit of a break, kind of a little mini vacation right now. I uh, took a week off of work because we were supposed to be going down to Georgia. We didn't end up going, so I've just been kind of taking a stay-at-home vacation. And uh, so, and uh, I haven't been getting, I haven't done any stitching at all. Besides, uh, nope, I haven't actually done any stitching at all because that the vacation started uh, Friday night. And I put up this video on Thursday, so there has been no stitching done at all. And I'm hoping that I'll be able to... I've wanted to stitch. Um, as I was saying earlier, the hardest thing of any project is just to start. So there's been times that I've wanted to stitch, but I just kind of like the thought of picking what piece I'm going to stitch on because I have a lot of projects. I have a lot of UFOs and uh, projects just in general. So you know, picking one to start with and, you know... As you can see, five minutes is not a lot of time to stitch, so when you're, I'm sitting down to stitch, I'm pretty much guaranteeing that it's going to be like an hour, if not like five hours process. So I have to be willing to like sit down and devote five hours to it. Or like at least plan to be stitching for an extremely long time. So... The hardest part of any project is to start, so picking it and then knowing you're going to devote so many hours to it um, is kind of like, just it just kind of psychs you out, I guess. I don't know if anybody else has this problem or if it's just me, 
Uh, we're quickly coming to the five minute mark, so I'm going to finish this stitch. And, and there we are. We got through another row and a half. That, t that tends to be our progress mark, another row and a half. But we've only got one, two, three more rows left to go. I'll probably change the thread off camera, and then tomorrow we will probably, I will try to finish it up, and we can go on to the back stitch. So I will see you guys tomorrow in the next episode. Bye-bye.